is the color of the grass where I used to read at Centennial Park. I used to think I would meet somebody there. Time, curious time, gave me no compass, gave me no sign. Were there clues I didn't see? Isn't it just so Hey guys, thanks for checking out this guitar lesson for Invisible String by Taylor Swift. So I'm in the middle of making lessons for the entire Folklore album, so make sure to check out that playlist for all the other songs. Um, I'll link to it below, and I'm also going to put the link at the end of the video. Alright, so let's jump into it. Uh, no capo or anything, just a bunch of chords. First chord is G, and you play that with middle finger on the third fret of low E, index on the second fret of A, ring on the third fret of B, and pinky on the third fret of high E. The next chord we'll call D slash F sharp. It's kind of the D chord, but the low note is F sharp, so that's what we're calling it. Uh, you put your index on the second fret of low E, middle finger on the second fret of G, and then uh, ring on the third fret of B, pinky on the third fret of high E. So those don't move there. The next chord is E minor, and you play that with middle finger on the second fret of A, ring on the second of D. And the next chord is B minor, so you play that with index finger on the second fret of A, ring on the fourth of D, pinky on the fourth of G, and middle on the third fret of B. So that takes you through the verse, and in order to play the chorus, you need to know one more chord, and that's D. You play that with index finger on the second fret of G, ring on the third fret of B, and middle on the second fret of high E. And there's one more chord you need to know for the song, and that's A minor. And you play that with middle finger on the second fret of D, ring on the second of G, and index on the first fret of B. So that's all the chords for the song. There's just a strumming pattern left. And the strumming pattern, same as most of the album, uh, really, she keeps it simple here, so it's a downstroke on every quarter note. So, one and two and three and four and one and two and three and four and... All right, pretty straightforward. Um, you know all the chords, you know all the strumming, so let's do it. Green is the color of the grass where I used to read at Centennial Park. I used to think I would meet somebody Alright, that's the song. I hope it was a lot of help. If you guys have any more questions or just general comments, leave them below. I'd be happy to answer them. And uh, make sure you check out the playlist for all the other folklore songs I did. And as always, make sure to subscribe so you catch all the things to come. Alright, thanks guys.